Hello fellow makeup lovers, how are you guys doing today? So I'm super excited for this video because I have a little announcement and I'm hoping that you guys will be excited too. So I have decided to do Amy All April this year, which is basically just like Vlogmas where you do a video every single day during the month, except it's in April because my name starts with an A. I love alliteration, so Amy All April just fit. And I did this two years ago. I really enjoyed it. I meant to do it last year. I forgot about it. This year, I actually pre-filmed and I have all the videos I need for the rest of March already done. So my trips got canceled and I'm just sitting here anxious, stressed, and I'm like, I just wanna play with makeup. I just wanna keep busy. I wanna be productive. Um, the world is crazy right now. So I thought, you know, it would be beneficial for me because it keeps me busy. It gives me something to do. I love making content. And also maybe you guys will enjoy it too because it's entertainment and it's a break from all the other things that are going on in the world. Even though makeup can seem so superficial, it can be relaxing and it can be self-care. So I feel like there is value in that and I just hope you guys will enjoy the extra content. So I'm gonna try and have a video up every single day in April. If I miss one day, <laughs> then it's fine. I'm not gonna like super, super stress. I'm starting to pre-film in advance, so it should be okay. I've got so many video ideas I wanna do. I've also been taking your guys' feedback into consideration because I asked y'all what videos you wanted to see and a lot of people <laughs> were very strongly saying they didn't wanna see as many reviews because of just, you know, not wanting to feel the pressure to buy things. Totally, completely understand that, especially in the uncertainty right now. I have already filmed some reviews. I have some new things coming, so I don't wanna like just pretend they're not here and not film with them, not use them at all. So there might be a little bit of that type of content, but I'm definitely gonna try my best to kind of talk about palettes that have already been out, using things that are in my stash, and just talking about things that a lot of us already own, or just maybe doing some more like commentary, get ready with me's, and just, you know, trying not to focus so much on new stuff. I mean, it's it's a part of life, and maybe some people still enjoy that because it's fun to hear about new things, and like I know I have a Cleona order, and I'm gonna wanna unbox it, and hopefully that will be okay with you guys. Um, actually, I don't know if that'll be up already or not. Depends on if I feel a little crazy and I wanna upload it early, but either way, I just wanted to let you know that I hear your concerns, I completely understand them, and I'm gonna do my best to do more of like shopping my stash kind of content. So I'm sure by the time you're seeing this video, half of this month's content has already been filmed, but if you have any suggestions for videos you'd like to see, feel free to comment them always. So before I end the video, I also wanted to let you know that today I am doing a giveaway. I just wanted to give back to a subscriber. I really, really hope this will be an exciting giveaway for whoever wins because, I don't know, I think it'd be a, I, I would be excited to win it. So I went ahead and, I went ahead. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I went ahead and put everything in this little Sephora bag that I have here, which I will go ahead and ship out. I'll probably like bubble wrap it 10 times over, but I don't know if you can tell there is a ton of single shadows in here. So some of them I received as extras in order, some I got in like goodie bags, some I got extra in PR, and some I went ahead and specifically purchased for this video. I'm gonna tell you guys the most exciting ones. They're shadows from Natasha Denona. I actually have two here. Um, one is this one, which I hope it's not silly that I'm putting this in here, um, but it's a little sample that I got from Sephora, and it's the shade Pure Love from the Love Palette. I actually have that all over my lid today. It's one of the prettiest shades in the palette, and I figured one of you guys could use it. I mean, who doesn't want a Josh Nona shadow? So I know that one's free, and that's kind of corny, but... I just thought I'd throw it in there. There's also Sydney Grace. There's a pressed glitter from Give Me Glow that I accidentally bought. There's some Ofra, some Anastasia Beverly Hills. There's a little bit of Cleona. There's some regular shadows from Cleona. And then also there is, um, I want to say this is Corrosion. If I remember the name correctly, this is my favorite shadow from the Stained Glass Collection. So I bought an extra one specifically for this giveaway because it is one of the most beautiful shades ever. There's some shades from um, Enchanted Luster Cosmetics from Australia. There's the ice cream collection from Luxie, which actually they're coming in little sleeves like this because whenever Luxie sent them, they said that they were out of their regular packaging. So I apologize, but they do say Luxie on the back. So 
all four shades from that collection are in here and they're really beautiful. There's a highlighter and some eyeshadows from Vanessa's Vanity. There's a shade from Touch of Glam, MBA Cosmetics. I have also, um, this one right here is from Enchanted Luster Cosmetics. It's not marked on the back, but this is the shade Soul Prism and it's one of my favorite shades from them as well. It is a really, really beautiful duochrome. I have some shades here. This one is Half-Life from Cleona. Um, I have another one from Cleona in this like packaging and then I have some in this packaging and I'm not sure which brand this one actually is. I'm so sorry. And then I also went ahead and included a little um, empty magnetic palette. It's not going to hold all of the shadows that are in there, but I did grab an extra one of these whenever they were on sale. But there's definitely some neutrals, some colorful shades, some mattes, some shimmers, some glitter. Um, just a really like hodgepodge of... Uh, single shadows. So I hope that'll be exciting to somebody. Um, if you are interested in winning this giveaway, I will have the rules in the description box, but it's just going to be, you know, please be subscribed to me and comment, comment something you're grateful for right now. I feel like that's always such a good exercise. And I'm just going to do like a, pick a random comment. I'm trying to think of when the giveaway will end, but I'm just going to leave that in the description box because I don't know if post offices are going to end up closing or something. So I don't want to choose a giveaway winner and then just be like sitting around for like three weeks before I'm able to get it in the mail. So we'll just play it by ear. I'll have the information in the description box. Let me know if you're excited for email April. I am. I'm excited to keep myself busy. That's that's who I am. I'm like, I could binge 12 Netflix shows or I could film 30 videos. Hmm. <laughs> So I hope you enjoy it and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.